Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Full Media Part 32 Challenge. In today's episode, we took a big step sideways. We were reflecting that we need, we've been talking about parallel projects, that the work on music feeds our other projects and our other projects feed our music. So. We have a project called a hybrid tech poster and we have a deadline tonight. So we said, well, why don't we dedicate today's stream to putting that poster together as everything is composing, so is everything a virtual reality. Why does that matter? Because this is the poster that we composed. You're looking at it here in a 3D virtual world and these are QR codes and what are called triggers. And if you had your smartphone out right now and pause the video, in fact, I'll do that for you. Even though that looks blurry, I'll wait for you. You could scan that with your phone, set your phasers to stun, your smartphone camera to scan, and uh, that would open up a website. And these other things, this one opens up and this one opens up. So. It was a challenge, and that was our theme for today, is challenge, because we're trying to demonstrate something in a restricted format. The restricted format is we had to be one image, uh, a portrait format. It had to have enough pixel density that the image uploaded into the virtual world could still be scanned from the desktop. And we tested that, and that worked. And then we went through and did a design. The other thing we set out to do is to see, could we apply what we've been learning composing uh, as we work on this poster? And these are the things, creating a space to compose into. So we created a, a blank portrait format on a uh, PowerPoint type program. We worked on multiple visuals to combine into there. We used Lyric and Illusion. We had like, how do I access the, let me count the ways, uh, hybrid tech. There's multiple ways to get to reach each other. Cycling back and forth between multiple tools. In fact, we counted one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We had 10 different tools in all that we used in today's stream to get to that image that we're showing you. And that, not the least of which is this actual viewer that we're using to look around and show you what's going on. The idea is people are gonna come in as avatars and meander about going, where are we? Wow, this is weird. And then uh, in the poster session, they say, you know, zoom in on the screen. And if they don't know how to zoom in on the screen, they just say, you know, walk over there and look up, you know. so. A, a, a live fire exercise of hybrid tech, multiple tech. <clears throat> so we did that, putting a lot of raw material in place before worrying about uh, fine tuning it. These are all the raw materials we had gathered to work with. And you've seen us do that with reference scores and reference spreadsheets and things. Using hand-drawn images as part of the inspiration for the composition. Um, that came up here and, and we had to use our image composer program to extract. Uh, first of all, it looked terrible because it was a dirty whiteboard. <laughs> Figure out how to go into a photo program and whiten the background and then come in here and extract the images and then tint them. And we had to go use Google Docs to get the right color and then tint the images and they were too faint. So we had to overlay them and flatten them. It was it was, we had fun. Sometimes more fun than you can handle. And we were using hand-drawn images. Uh, and then we made the analogy that a lot of times we compose music and then we download the MP3 files into the animation tool. And then every time we update the music, we re-download the files. So we made several versions of the actual poster, which as we said, is being done here in a Google Docs, uh, uh, whatever it's called, slides, I think. 
So uh, we made several versions of these, and you do the file download into a download into a ping, and then from the ping, you pick it up from here, where you go into the build upload image, and there they are. So that's how that works. It's very similar to working between uh, the music or composing program and the uh, uh, music visualizer program, Magic Music Visualizer. And this is an example of using photo. So that was kind of our final image that we liked, but this is, these two are the raw images and we use a separate program to get that, that black ink out of the way at the bottom right. And then we use this program to lighten it up because it was the best program for lightening it up. And that's the whole theme of our talk, which is, uh, well, we might as well show you another thing we were using. Here, here is our uh, notes. In, in addition to gathering all the images and stuff, we're gathering the, the quotes and things. We still have to write a script for that. These are the next steps we have to do. We have to, there's another poster presentation in another virtual app, and we have to make sure the image works there. We need to write a script for the presentation because we have to talk. And uh, what else? We we're going to say something else about that. But I guess the point, oh, there was the definition of hybrid tech. Hybrid tech means combining tools in optimal ways, play to their strengths, mediate their weaknesses. So we had two different photo tools. One was excellent at kind of getting rid of left, leftover junk, like that big black ink, and the other was better at turning the background to look whiter and cleaner. So we're pretty chuffed. We're pretty chuffed we got this done, especially because we have a deadline. Um, this, we actually have a couple more weeks to fine tune it and test it and whatnot. And as we like to say, well done is well, well begun is half done. And we really do believe in that. So, so what are we going to do? Um, we were kind of, uh, it was kind of a tease to play that score for you. So we'll just play this score for you one more time. This is going to be our dramatic intro to <laughs> to the current version of the slides. Here we go. There you go. There you go. You saw it here first. So we look forward to seeing you in the next episode, which will return to actual music scoring. Thank you for your attention, curiosity, time, and interest, and hopefully patience and enjoyment of today's slightly unusual stream. We look forward to seeing you in the next episode. And as always, keep on streaming. <laughs>